We begin tonight with Veterans Day events being held all across San Diego County, including at Miramar National Cemetery. And that's where Gold Star families were honored today with the unveiling of a new monument. And Fox 5's Lani Latang was at that dedication ceremony. She starts us off live from Miramar with a look and the details. Alani. Andrew Maria, good afternoon and what a great celebration. This really dedication celebration. It was both emotional, but also a happy time for uh, these military families to really come together and bond over a loved one that they lost. And we got a chance to speak to some of those families and they say when they look at that monument, it just brings them back to a time with their loved one. Two, one and two. the black cloth pulled off. It's perfect. It's perfect. They couldn't do anything better than what they gave us here today. A new Gold Star Families Memorial revealed at Miramar National Cemetery. It's double sided, wrapped with messages of sacrifice, patriotism and freedom, plus a saluting soldier cutout. Gold Star Families is a title given to a military family who've lost loved ones in the line of duty. The 132nd. These two are daughters of the Vietnam War. Patricia Lee and Shirley Love. They both lost their fathers in Vietnam. Patricia's dad was 38 years old and served for nearly 19 years with the Army. Patricia was 12 years old at the time. He was a hero. He was awarded a Silver Star. And he was brave. So this says thank you to him too, not just my family. Shirley was one years old when her dad was killed at 19 years old. He served two years with the Army when she saw the monument. It's kind of like one of those wow and just in awe and just taking it in. It's it's beautiful and, and I'm thankful. Um, that we have that here. The Woody Williams Foundation led the monuments initiative to San Diego. Woody was the last living Medal of Honor recipient from World War II. He died last year at 98 years old. As you learn the names of those who paid the ultimate sacrifice. Chad Graham is Woody's grandson and president of the foundation. The thing that everyone noticed was his humility. You know, his, his motto was the cause is greater than I and that's how he lived his life. Graham says Grandpa Woody wore his medal in honor of Gold Star families. Bringing a monument to San Diego is Woody's continued legacy. It belongs to these families. So to have somewhere that is theirs, they can call their own a permanent place. And so especially with the amount of families we have here, it's just it's, it is the right thing to do. For the daughters of Vietnam, they say the monument is a way to remember and honor their dad. I guess I never grieved my father, but I just had this long, long missing something. It's emotional still. Oh, yeah. It, it never goes away. Being a Gold Star kid, you have a broken heart forever. It doesn't change. It doesn't matter how much time has passed. The Woody Williams Foundation tells us that they have 132 of these gold star monuments across 50 states and Guam, and they're working on another 65 of these monuments. Reporting live in Miramar, I'm Alani Latang, Fox 5 News. So